Ooh, hello. This is what I eat in a day. Breakfast. We're going to have grilled banana. Really? Yeah. Are you excited for it? I am. Banana tastes better when it's grilled. I don't know this recipe. Really? It's super easy. You just put a little bit of like light butter on there, then grill it, and then grab some toast, whack some ricotta on it, bananas go on top, drizzle a bit of it, blueberries, blueberries, this is what you're going to say This is the bit that's like, it's like moment of truth because if you break the banana, like obviously it's fine, but I'm going to treat it as life or death situation. Oh, it just doesn't look good. Yeah. Okay, so it really is fine. So it really is fine, but at the same time, is it? And that's your backup? That's my backup. If things go horribly wrong, I'm relying on this one half to take me through the day. And sorry, just to be clear, horribly wrong just means if it splits. Correct. In which case, we still do get to eat, right? <laughs> yeah, we still get to eat. But it's less satisfying. Right. I feel like I need to confess though, because I film what I eat in a day is on much more chill dates. Um, the last two weeks we've literally been eating porridge. And you guys know I don't like porridge, but it's quick. And it, I make it for you. It's quick and Mario makes it. So can I complain? No. <laughs> Plus, we've got a little bit of a secret ingredient in there. Let me show it to you. Oh. Chocolate milk. So you can hardly call it porridge. It's more like a chocolate soup. Chocolate oat chowder. Chocolate oat chowder. <laughs> that with fruit. Good. Okay, you got it? I'm feeling pretty full. I've got like half of my toast left. Um, and I was gonna put it away and save it for tomorrow, but Mario's just, Mario's requested. For the extra. <laughs> I just can't get over that throughout this entire video there's going to be whistling in the background. <laughs> I know, can you hear it? <laughs> so I'm going to do one of my classic workouts. One of the workouts that I've been doing since my physio said I could go back to doing some weight training. And yeah, they just make me feel really happy because I feel like I'm getting my strength back. I feel like I'm getting my confidence back. And so far, it's been like four weeks. I haven't had like a... Um, I haven't had like a, what's it called? Like an episode? Not really an episode, but where my back's like cramped up and I haven't been able to move. I haven't had one of those and I'm feeling really good. If the weights look heavy, by the way, it's only because they are chunky. They're not, they're not actually super heavy. They look really heavy, but they're not actually heavy. So it's all good. She's bringing out the big guns. 200 kilos? Oh, at least, at least. 250? It feels like 300. It feels like 300. Yeah, you know oh, when- It's it... actually 200, but it feels like 300. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> this is your little workout journal, isn't it? Yeah, all of these are like my workouts.
Complete. Complete. So that's currently what my workouts are looking like. And I'm feeling really good. Like, I feel like I'm getting stronger. I've been doing those kind of, these kinds of workouts like every other day. For me, it's like the habit of working out. Like every other day, it feels like really manageable. And it's just something that I can actually stick to. And it's funny because in the past, I used to train like five, sometimes six days a week trying to stick to that now is just it just wouldn't happen i know that i wouldn't have created that habit and stuck to that routine in the first place so it's good for me to just be really realistic with what i can achieve and so far so good it's been like basically since i've made that comeback video i've stuck to it every other day doing a weights workout and then the other day is just doing like a very light walk basically just getting out of the apartment lunchtime. Okay, so we're making an orzo salad, which is basically like a pasta salad, but the pasta looks like rice. This is, Mario's mum gave us this. Gritaraki, gritaraki. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? Oh. Gritaraki. Hondro. Pretty good. Is that good? Apple. 100% whatever that is. <laughs> Skliru Pitario. That's good, Baba. And that's it. Seriously? This recipe is super, super easy. You just basically, I'm just going to chop these in half. Done. I'm going to chop that up a little bit. Chop these up. Take this out of the can. Chuck all of that into a salad bowl. Mix once that's done after 11 minutes. With the knife. With the knife. Yeah. And you're done. I really don't like to spend much time on lunch, you know, because lunch is that time where it's like, do we have time? You know, and the answer is usually like, no, not really. How cute are these little peppers? They're so cute. Right, Mario's dad. This is for you. This is a gift that Mario's dad got me for Christmas. It's a <laughs> Liverpool merchandised apron. I mean, come on, with your in-laws, can I get any better? I'm doing the orzo for <laughs> my Greek, for your mum. I've got the Liverpool apron on for your dad. <laughs> it's got to get me brownie points. I dedicate this meal to Mario's parents. <laughs> With salads like this, you can just put anything you want in it. Tomatoes, feta. Feta would have been good. Feta would have been good. Mm -hmm. Spinach, if you want to put spinach, anything you want. That was so good. And very quick. Oh, what's that, like possibly. 10 minutes? 10 minutes. 10 minutes, if you're being like chill about it, 12 at a push, but no more. 12 minutes. If you're going over 12, something's gone wrong. My umbrella for the day is Mario's hoodie. As always, we're, we're not, we're not we're wildly not, on time. We're not early, let's put it that way. <laughs> so we're on the hunt for an office. Um, this is for the company that me and Mario have co-founded, which we're super excited about. Um, it doesn't have anything to do with YouTube whatsoever. When it launches, I won't, I just, I won't, I'm not the face of it or anything. So I'm very excited. And we have a team already, which they're amazing, but we don't see them that often. But obviously because of COVID, everyone's working at home. So um, we want to find like an office that's really like motivating, that's fun, um, that we can all kind of come together and discuss everything. Because I personally really like offices. Um, I just you just want to hang out with everyone don't you i just i need friends basically um is that's why i'm getting an office is just to hang out with my friends but we are friends with them that's but not why we picked them we I mean, weren't friends before i didn't know them before why is this sounding so bad this is not like Something some kind this. of nepotism it sounds really dodgy <laughs> yeah i know <laughs> you've become friends with them yeah i've become friendship has grown over time
Oh, what your feet see. <laughs> That was not worth it. Okay, Mario. That's quite pretty, isn't it? Now think about it. Yeah. This is your office. I mean, I'm biased because I love this area, but come on. Is it bad to want to live in an office? I like it. <laughs> I like it as well. <laughs> I love it. So this office isn't for like right now. It's for when things open up again. So we're just trying to plan ahead, you know. So we're probably going to move in in like two, three months once lockdown has kind of eased. What about cross town? Is there a cross town near here? We are viewing offices, but let's get to the important things. Stephanie. The first thing Stephanie said to us was, are you guys going to cross town? <laughs> no. <laughs> she just caught you red-handed without even like... Are we that predictable? <laughs> are you going cross town? We're not going to rush, we're just going to enjoy it. We're going to park the car. <laughs> park the car, I don't know where. We're going to give Crosstown the respect it right. deserves. Take there these seatbelts off. The jumper off. Why? In case I get the donut sweats. <laughs> donut sweats. You haven't gone for that for a while. Mm. Look at all that jam. Look at all that cake. <laughs> oh yeah. There's the blackberry. Mm -hmm. This side of my mouth is getting a lot of action because my tooth is growing through on this side. And it's really... My wisdom tooth is growing on this side of my mouth. So this side is getting a lot of action. Take update. Um. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! It's I've got no. I've got no clean hands. Oh, I'm literally Natasha. incapable of doing. Oh, look at this. Oh, I'm sorry. What are you doing? I'm going over these nutrition facts about almonds, just in case something new is going on almond wise. What? Stop it. Siri is literally in his own planet. Why was this in my bag? <laughs> nice. Done. It is so weird to see no one on the streets in Regent Street. Usually, you're literally weaving in and around people all the time. I really want to touch this. Wow.
my brother got me these for Christmas. I actually do want to get better for the summer of roller skating. I see people outside and they're so good. They're so good. And I am so bad. So I need to step up my game, you know? Yeah, she's getting it. This is all I call the jouster. Oh, no. <laughs> Does work. Yes. Crossover. Ooh. Why does everything look so much better, slow mo? We're going to send this off to the Olympic team as <laughs> okay. your application. Ready? <laughs> yes. <laughs> They're going to be so shocked when I meet them in person. <laughs> We're having dinner. We're having a special fajitas dinner. And Mario, Mario's going to be taking control of this one. I'm going to be your sous chef. You made them the other night and they were spectacular. We got the tortilla wraps. The lime. The pepper, chicken, yeah. avocado, two avocados, sour cream, cheddar cheese, cheddar cheese, refried beans. What? My catching is really good tonight. I don't know what this is. What is this? Chicken seasoning, onions, two onions. We're in the kitchen tonight, Mario. What are we cooking? Uh, fajitas. I feel alive. How much effort does this require? Um, it requires a lot less than it looks like. There's a lot of ingredients, but most of the ingredients you just put in a bowl. Great. That's all I need to know. And in terms of timing, how, timing. Long, how long do you reckon this is going to take? Because um, I'm saying it now, I'm hungry. 20 minutes. That's, you said 20 minutes. No, but that's just gonna... She's actually timing me because I said 20 minutes. I'm just saying you're, <laughs> you're half a minute in, but I'm who's down. counting? I'm not counting. Don't, don't be too fussy with it. Just rough. Rough is good. Go rough with it, <laughs> all right? The Drop the ego. Fajitas are a no ego zone. Again, no pressure, absolutely no pressure. Right. Absolutely none, but four and a half minutes. I don't have time for this. So these are the refried beans. I don't usually eat beans because it makes me feel a certain way. It ain't liquid and it ain't solid, which means it's... <laughs> which means it's the other state, the other <laughs> physical state. I'm gonna eat two of them. I just wanna do them one at a time so I can truly appreciate, you know? Also, we use the mild version on all of these ingredients because um, someone, I'm not gonna say who, just can't take it in the spice realm, you know? So, you know, that we've all got to make like sacrifices. That makes it sound like it's me, it's her. She can't take any heat whatsoever. No, I think everyone knows that I'm really oh. bad with spice. Uh, and to be honest, <laughs> this is mild and I'm still feeling the heat. Can it see that? I'm not sure I understand. Siri. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> The thing that is so good about making too much, because we made too much for tonight, but we can use that again tomorrow. Tomorrow I get to relive the joy all over again with some fajita bowls. 
I'm basically just gonna grab all the ingredients that are left, chuck it in a bowl, mix it. Maybe I won't mix it. I don't know how I feel tomorrow, but it's gonna be good. Mario's favorite thing is just to search Netflix. It's not actually to watch something. And then I go to bed. <laughs> I'm just finishing off the day with some berries and then we're gonna watch The Matrix because I just need another trilogy in my life, you know? We've watched Star Wars, we've watched Batman trilogy, we've watched The Lord of the Rings. This was like a nice, chilled, I still did, we still did some work, but it was very chilled compared to usual, so it was really nice. It felt really kind like... Kind of like a day off, kind of. Kind of like a day off. As close to a day off as we're going to get now. Like a half day off. Yeah, like a half day off. And it was really fun seeing those offices. You know when something just motivates you to work? That's how I felt when we were in those offices. So I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us. Um, I love you guys so much. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and give me a big thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you guys very soon. I love you so much. Bye bye. What, why, why do we both need to have not seen the film? It doesn't make it needs sense. It to be new for both of us. Why? Is what I mean. We're going to keep scrolling for an hour and a half. <laughs>